you can see here's my jig right here and there are fish quite a few fish under it um, I've had a really hard time finding them this morning it's the end of end of May and it doesn't look like these guys want to bite uh, there's one racing up to it. Oop, I just missed one got one right on it a couple of them that are there um, yeah it's been a, a really really tough fine not even f tough bite um, here come one's coming racing up to it um, as you can see it's really calm and there are loads and loads of bugs uh, these little they, there's one all oh, these little mosquitoes um, mosquito looking things um, like more than I've ever seen feels like a lake trout uh, yeah I think it's a lake trout um, really that's I've been out here over an hour and that's one of the first fish that I've marked uh, I kind of thought there was something wrong with my graph but um, I don't know if these fish are suspended and I just found these fish close to the bottom or what but you can see this this fish is burping you're gonna see bubbles coming up in a minute which tells me it's a lake trout you can see those bubbles maybe you see all that interference those are bubbles and you should be able to see some coming up here soon uh, feels like a decent laker um, Yeah, it is a nice laker. Let's see it down there. You see, you're going to see bubbles coming up real soon. Um, I'll keep him. He's not huge. Uh, actually, he might not even go 20 inches. But look at all the bugs. I don't know where all these came from. Well, I guess off the boat. Um, but that's what we're dealing with here. Anyway, he's a pretty nice laker. He'll eat good.